Hi guys, so sometimes it's interesting to look on the other side of the looking glass and see how Brexiteers are reacting to news. Now this is from the Express. Now the Express is a pro-Tory, pro-Brexit, really pro-Brexit newspaper. They, it's basically a bin fire when it actually comes to reporting about Brexit because on numerous occasions they've um, published articles about how the chief negotiator, Michel Barnier, is being sidelined, he's going to be fired, the EU is angry with him, member states are angry with him, and uh, he's about to lose his job. And they've run numerous reports on this over the last year, more or less. Uh, so they're not something you can take seriously. But it is interesting to look at how they react to real news. So they have this uh, headline here in an article, Joe Biden picks Brexit hater who compared EU exit to Le Pen in France. Now, <laughs> who they're talking about is a guy called Anthony Blinken. So, Blink so Blinken used to work in the Obama administration. He's a longtime Biden confidant who served as a number two in the State Department as a deputy national security advisor to Barack Obama. Remember, Biden used to be Barack Obama's vice president. Now, in the article, they talk about how he described um, Brexit as a total mess. He said uh, it's similar to the rise of Marie Le Pen in France. He described the UK's handling of Brexit as as that of a dog that had caught a car and then the car seems to, <laughs> seems to go in reverse and run over the dog. It's a total mess. The Brexiteers don't like the idea of someone like this in the US administration. Now, is this going to affect a trade deal with the UK? I don't think so. Individuals are not going to shape policy, with the exception of probably the president himself. But if the if the US sees it as beneficial for them to have a trade deal with the UK, then they will do that. The one caveat, of course, is the Good Friday Agreement in Northern Ireland. And the Biden administration, potential Biden administration, the one that's been formed at the moment, have been very clear that they see uh, Northern Ireland as very important for them. And if it's undermined in any way, peace in Northern Ireland is undermined, then the UK will not get a trade deal. So it's very important to look at what's going to happen over the next number of weeks before Biden takes office and see what Boris Johnson is going to do about the internal market bill, because the internal market bill could be the deal breaker if uh, the US and the UK want to have a trade deal. But once again, it's interesting to look at how Brexiteers are reacting to this news. Um, but I don't advise going to the Express because it really is a terrible website. <laughs> Let me know in the comments section, guys, what you think. As always, your comments are greatly appreciated. Thanks a lot.